Cardell Hayes successfully sued the city of New Orleans and the NOPD and in 2011 received a hefty settlement. Sources say it was seven figures. Now check out this video from December 2005, just months after Hurricane Katrina. Hayes father Anthony is the man wielding a pocket knife on St. Charles Avenue in this video. He was shot and killed by NOPD officers. The officers were not disciplined and the shooting deemed justified. But Hayes son and other family members sued, saying the lethal use of force was not necessary and cops should have used another means to subdue their father, like a taser. But back then, only SWAT team officers were equipped with those. Hayes' father was mentally ill and just prior to being shot, got into an altercation with a clerk at a nearby Walgreens. Coincidentally, on the scene that day in 2005, and named in the lawsuit, Captain Billy Saravolo. As we first reported, Saravolo was also with Smith Saturday night and snapped this picture at a Magazine Street sushi restaurant less than an hour before the shooting. Saravolo is retired from the NOPD and is personal friends with Smith and his family. We asked the chief about the connection. I understand that to be a fact, but we, we have no information to suggest that that incident that occurred back then had anything to do with the shooting last night. As for Hayes, he played prep football at Warren Easton and in low-level professional and semi-pro leagues. He also reportedly has worked on a Hollywood production shot in New Orleans in recent years, playing, of all things, a football player. Hayes has previously been arrested for being in possession illegally of a firearm. I'm Travers Mackle. Gina, back to you.